Hello, and welcome to Cindy's Corner. Today, boys and girls, we're going to review the book, Little Black Goes to the Circus. If you got it, go get it so you can follow along. This is a great book. How many of you know the book Black Beauty? Okay, well, it's similar. Okay, it's a short, it's really a great, great book. And its um, author is Walter Farley. And the illustrator is James Sugar. And my AR testers, this is a level 1-8. So 1-8. I call my pony Little Black. He and I are good friends. Little Black will do anything for me. Do you have a pet like that? He will do tricks for me. He will open a gate. He will jump over things. When he is tired of tricks, he gets down. Then I get on his back and we go for rides. One day, we went for a long ride. We came to a man putting up a sign. It said, Bruno's Circus. The circus was coming to town. Come on, little black, I said. Let's see the circus. Let's see it come to town. Little black ran very fast. Soon, we came to the circus tents. We saw circus wagons. Then we saw circus animals and circus people. We saw Mr. Bruno. Mr. Bruno said to his men, Come on, get the animals out. Then, Mr. Bruno worked with the animals. He made them do tricks. He made a monkey ride a little bike. Next, he worked with an elephant. He made that big elephant get up on a little box. Then, he worked with a pony. Mr. Bruno made him walk on two feet. He made that pony walk across the ring. All at once, Little Black jumped up. He got up on his two feet, just like the circus pony. Mr. Bruno looked up in surprise. What is this? He asked. What is going on here? Then Little Black fell down. He fell down hard. All the circus people laughed. Take that pony away, said Mr. Bruno. He is no good. He is no circus pony. Get him out of here. I took Little Black away. I had to pull him. His head was down. His tail was down. Don't be sad, little black, I said. You are a good pony. Mr. Bruno does not know a good pony when he sees one. I wanted to make my pony happy. Little black, I said, let's have our own circus. Having it in the tree, isn't he? I know a new trick you can do. I bet you can walk across this plank. Come on, try it. He's walking across. There's a creek right there. Come on, come on. Don't stop. Keep going, little black. You will do it. You think he's going to get it? You think? You did it! You are a good pony. You are just as good as any circus pony. The 
ran. Little Black pulled away. He ran. Little Black, I called. Where are you going? Come back. Come back. Where do you think he's headed? To the circus. I ran after him. I ran as fast as I could. But Little Black ran faster. He was going back to the circus. Stop, I yelled. But Little Black ran on. Went into the circus, didn't he? He ran right into the big tent. I ran into the big tent, too. All the circus people were looking at something. What had happened to my pony? There he was. He was on a plank. There was Mr. Bruno, too. Well, said Mr. Bruno, that pony is good. Show him I can do that. You think he saw that plank while ago when he was there? Probably. Now, let's see just how good you are. Get up there. Try your trick on a high plank. Oh, he's going to go way up high. Oh, no. Don't. Please, Mr. Bruno, I yelled. Little Black will fall. You think he'll get up there and fall? Uh-oh. What has he got? He's got a harness, doesn't he? He can't fall far. This belt will hold him. Come on, little black, said Mr. Bruno. Come on. Hurry up. Nothing will happen. But then something did happen. Little Black fell, but he did not fall far. The belt held him up. Let him down, I yelled, but they did not do it. They pulled him back up. Then everything was all right. Little Black walked right across the plank. I was glad it was all over. You think it's over? But it was not over. Mr. Bruno took off his, the belt. Now, said Mr. Bruno, let's see you walk back across that plank. His eyes are big, aren't they? Uh-oh. Little Black started, then he stopped. Don't stop, I yelled. You will fall. Keep going. Don't look down. Please do as I say. He's yelling at him, and he's telling him what to do. Little Black did as I said. He got there. He was so happy. He got up on his back. His two back feet. You did it, Little Black, I yelled. You did the big circus trick. Little Black came down, but I could not get near him. He had a lot of friends now. Now, they did not laugh at him. Little Black, said Mr. Bruno, I will make you the star of my circus. Gave him a blanket and a hat. I went out to, of the tent. I sat down to think. My pony wanted to stay with the circus. He wanted to be a circus star. I did not want to let him go, but I wanted him to be happy. I did not know what to do. Then I heard something. I looked up. It was Little Black. He came running out of the tent. He was running away from the circus. He was running to me. 
he stopped, he got down, he wanted me to get on his back. He did not want to stay with the circus. He wanted to go home with me. He's getting on. We ran, we jumped, we did tricks all the way home. It was hard to tell who was happier, Little Black or I. Now, have you ever been to a circus? Have you had an animal participate in the circus? If you have, tell me. Have you ever wanted to be in the circus? If you have, tell me that too in the comments. And would you have given Little Black up if he was yours and let him stay with the circus? Tell me in the comments after you hit that subscribe button so you can share Cindy's Corner with your family and friends. And most important, just like you're going to give your pet or your horse a hug, give somebody a hug and tell them you love them. Have a great day.